We're here at a fantastic new facility, the Europa Centre, home to Europa Gymnastics Club run by Len and Yvonne Arnold. British Gymnastics funded £600,000 toward this £5.5 million project and we're here to see how this facility has benefited the club and its members. Len and Yvonne Arnold are a couple who dedicated their life to gymnastics. In her youth, Yvonne was a British and Olympic gymnast who captained Britain's 1972 Olympic team in Munich. She's now Director of Coaching at Europa, whilst husband Len is the Managing Director. Both Len and Yvonne have coached many national and international gymnasts throughout their time at the club. Oh, I started gymnastics when I was 11 and my dad worked in the local school and the local gym club moved in and I used to go and watch at the windows and then go into the garden and try and do it. And uh, my mum and dad said, I think perhaps we better learn this properly. My first actual experience was leaning on the door of the gym, um, wondering whether these kids were crazy or just the most amazing thing I'd ever seen. Um, I, coming from football and various ball sports, it, um, you know, it was totally different and I have to say I was slightly mesmerised by it. Len and Yvonne opened their first gymnastics premises on Fraser Road in Erith, Kent. Born from a rundown building on an industrial site, this facility housed the usual gymnastics equipment but was split across three storeys. However, as Europa developed, the Fraser Road facility was no longer sufficient to meet the needs of the club. So in 2012, they opened the new Europa Centre at this site on Maiden Lane. We've tried to um, incorporate all the things that we had at the other gym, at the old gym, here as well. So we have a weightlifting studio, we have a boxing studio, we have a martial arts studio and a dance studio, all separate, which is fantastic. And we've also got a brand new fitness suite as well, which is brilliant, and I might even get to use it myself later on. <laughs> the plans for the new Europa Centre attracted recognition and funding from far and wide. British Gymnastics funded £600,000 towards the project. British Gymnastics came along then under the guise of Mark Gannon and, you know, was strong possibility of funding. But it weren't just the funding, it was the fact that Mark came down to various meetings and just gave the whole project credibility from British Gymnastics' point of view. But I very much appreciate the support we got from BG, but as I said, particularly from Mark. This place seems like a dream and I, I just seriously think I'm going to wake up at some stage and realise that it's not happening, but it, it is happening and um, yeah, it has been an emotional roller coaster. but we're, we're on, we're on the, the peak now. I sort of look back over it and I really do believe if somebody had written it as a story, people would go, nah, it wouldn't happen like that. And every single person that comes through the door, the wow factor is incredible and um, I hope that the wow factor stays with us for a long, long time. Well, we've had an amazing day here at the Europa Centre. It really is a state-of-the-art facility run by two extraordinary people. I've been Olivia Howard. We've been BGTV. Thanks for watching.